Today I'm going to show you how to disassemble ASUS laptop. Uh, model is um, N550J. So we are going to disassemble this laptop for today, and I am showing how to disassemble and making thermal paste for it. So let's start. So we need to, we need. Um, Six uh, angled screwdriver. <coughs> Removing these screws. So let's remove all of them. And now we are going to remove cover, this cover, uh, maybe if at, the, at the first time we need to check, maybe there is no any screws under the legs, so we have to remove this cover. Be careful, may, may there be some connectors and motherboard pull up carefully so there is no screws it's so dusty we have to clean this one and now uh, we have to disconnect these CPU fan connectors one and two so two connectors are disconnected and now we have to remove screws of the CPU fan are here we have to remove the screws but 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 I forget we first of all we have to remove mm. battery because when uh, you are using to remove in the screws maybe some uh, short circuit may uh, become while uh, removing the screws connected on the battery so first of all we have to remove battery battery screws there and disconnect the connector of the laptop so it is so dirty we have to clean this battery also so we have 
three, three screws of the battery and we removed two screws of the CPU fan the smallest one is here this is smallest screw here smallest one also the small ones small these two screws and long these two screws so we have to now we have to remove uh, CPU screws CPU and GPU screws we have to remove them diagonally not all of them at, at the same time because you may damage your GPU or CPU you have to remove screws like uh, a tire on the car you are removing The old screws are here on the magnet and now we have to pull up this radiator Cooper radiator it's it's very hard to remove because all thermal paste is almost dry so Now I'm going to replace this one here as radiator to clean and at the second this laptop on the next time. So we have to clean this. radiator using clean paper this old thermal paste is almost dry 